What's up everybody, it's your boy Chop, coming back at you with another Halo lore video, cause the only thing better than updating knowledge is to share that knowledge. And today, we're gonna be talking about some pretty dark Halo lore that is totally 100% legitimate and canonized by 343. You can even ask him yourself. Now, this stuff is pretty dark and controversial. So controversial that I don't even think Hidden Xperia would cover it on his channel. But somebody's gotta do it, and I'm feeling up to it. So let's just get right into this. Now, in the past, my Halo lore videos really only talked about the UNSC, and I didn't really get much into the Covenant at all. So, that's what I was kind of looking for for this video. I was searching around on the interwebs for something interesting about the Covenant that nobody really knows or has really talked about. And I found something pretty bizarre. Now, the Covenant as a whole is a pretty large organization group, you know, with its own uh, religion, different uh, ministries, councils, sort of like warrior orders or I guess knighthoods you could call them and I was looking at these different orders and I found one that caught my eye the now excuse my pronunciation the Delora Anna Delora Ag Anagrorum I'm not gonna try and say that twice <laughs> is a small but deadly group of Sangheili warriors in the Covenant. And as far as I can tell, not much is really known about them. They don't really have much of a history, and what history they do have is uh, pretty freaking weird. So, to start off, the name translated into English is, and I kid you not, Consumer of ass. What a name. However, I don't think these uh, elites were just merely uh, eating the booty like groceries, nor they, were they just booty connoisseurs. The order itself was known to be gluttonous and unsanitary, with members um, reportedly cannibalizing on their victims' booties. These elites supposedly literally consumed their kills ass. That's that's pretty fucking weird. And besides that one fact, not much else is known about the order. It was small, very small, but its uh, warriors were um, highly skilled and highly trained, and they had... I guess you could say grotesque slash kinky tastes. And the order itself was not really uh, well liked by the other ministries of the Covenant, specifically the Ministry of Sanitation, which was concerned with the conditions relating to public health and sanitation in the Covenant. Uh, but the order was tolerated due to their skill and prowess in battle. Now, the only other account of these guys actually appearing in Halo at all is uh, actually during the Battle of Reach, where, uh, according to this, a uh, group of dummy-thick Spartans, yeah, we're bringing those back, encountered the uh, Order while en route to another mission, and let's just say the outcome was not in their favor. The one marine who survived the encounter described the elites as fanatics and, and suicidal, throwing away all thoughts of preservation in order to get some of that booty. Before he even knew what happened, he and the squad was swarmed by elites trying to pin everyone down onto the ground. Through some miracle, he managed to escape and hid. As he watched the whole thing unfolded, elites dogpiled the dummy thick Spartans and ate them alive. He describes the remains as crater ass. 
and hid with silent tears, fearing the same fate would come to him. Now, this um, piece of information also uh, leads me to believe that this is another reason why the Dummy Thick Spartan program was kind of canned, as Dummy Thick Spartans were you know, prime targets for this uh, order because of how goddamn thick they are. Word got out about this freaky order of elites and were nicknamed ass munchers by the troops. However, the story itself was so ridiculous that many questioned the legitimacy of these elites, and the stories were used in basic training to scare recruits into watching their calories, because you don't want no elite coming for you because you're too thick. Now, besides this one encounter, we never hear from this group of elites again, probably because they're really ridiculous, but who knows? Maybe we'll hear from them again in Halo Infinite. I, I kind of hope not. That's all I have for you guys today. I uh, hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something. Thank you for enjoying my weird content. Uh, as long as it makes someone chuckle, even just a little bit, it makes me happy. And uh, if you like what you see, please uh, subscribe and uh, like the video if you liked it. And I'll see you next time.